The end comes quick in Action Comics issue 997. Confronting Lawzod, Superman tells Booster to stop joking around and deal with the Eradicator as he takes on the young Kryptonian. Superman knows he has to be careful of Lawzod's rage, which becomes fully apparent when he is locked in a heat vision battle with the boy, who says that he will take the House of El banner from Superman's chest and drape it over his mutilated corpse. Superman emerges victorious from the heat vision battle, but is attacked by yet another Kryptonian, revealed to be the now older General Zod. In Logamba's governmental palace, Lois sneaks through the hallways. She is almost caught by a guard, had it not been for a friend of Sam Lane, who helps Lois thanks to Sam promising to free them from the oppressive regime. Sneaking into the prison, she is again caught, but this time she is saved by what she thinks is Superman, but soon learns it is John. Not stopping to talk about her son tagging along, they find Sam's cell. John breaks the door open and for the first time meets his grandfather father, who is confused as to why Lois would bring a child to a war zone. On New Krypton, Superman and Booster are strung up in front of the people and their rulers, General Zod, Ursa and Law Zod. They say how much they despise the Phantom Zone, but Superman says that it was the only place that could hold Zod's army, and if he truly cared for his family, he wouldn't have involved them in this. As they are readied for execution, Skeets quietly gets into position, however the General knows about the robot, destroying it with heat vision and having Law Zod stamp on it. Superman asks why Zod cares so much for the past, and he says because of how the House of El treated his family and what they stole from him. He also says that once he finds the time machine they came with, he would change that and kill Superman and put Lois and John in the Phantom Zone. The Zod Van Lee continue to beat on Superman, wanting to kill him desperately. Zod reveals that the public executions were at first looked down upon by the people, but soon they took to them as a form of worship. Surrounding the two heroes, Zod's family and the Eradicator unleash their heat vision on them, but Booster's force field activates, giving Superman precious seconds to think of something, but nothing comes to him except for thoughts of Lois and John. Lois and John meanwhile escape with Sam into a forest nearby the city. Sam still can't believe a child is there with Lois, but John says that he can handle himself. A nearby machine gun nest spots them and opens fire on the three of them, supposedly killing Sam and Lois. Action Comics issue 9 197 was an action-packed cliffhanger field issue that saw our two stories take some pretty dark turns as Superman is left at the mercy of the Zod family and Lois and her father are seemingly killed trying to escape Lagamba. I really enjoyed Superman's fight with both Law Zod and General Zod as they dredged up a lot of the history these characters have with one another and it was really cool seeing that history sort of hinted at. It wasn't outrightly said but it was hinted at and I really liked that sort of concept continuity with these characters. I'm really looking forward to next issue of the arc and what may feature some time travel shenanigans again. I'm going to give this issue a 9 out of 10. Hey everyone, thanks for watching my newest video. If you enjoyed it, you might also like to check out my other reviews here on my channel. You can also follow me on various social media platforms like Twitter by searching Matt underscore FOS or even join the Comic Multiverse Discord server and chat with other comic book fans including myself and Joel from Cape Joel. Want cheap comics and trades? Head over to the book depository with the link in the description to get the cheapest trades and comics around, along with free shipping anywhere in the world. Until next time, this has been Matt of the Fortress of Solitude. Thank you so much for watching.